this guided meditation experience is designed as a manifestation tool for helping you manifest successful astral projection outcomes. It's not an astral projection technique in and of itself, and therefore not a replacement for your existing astral projection practice. Nevertheless, its purpose and power should not be underestimated as each word has been crafted to clear old patterns while activating the downloads that have been held in trust and grace by your guides and helpers in anticipation of your readiness to explore beyond the illusion of physical reality. Used every day for 30 days, in addition to your regular astral projection practice, this meditation will help you build and strengthen the necessary energy pathways between your physical body and your astral body. Once these pathways are fully established, you will naturally awaken to the divine consciousness locked within your astral body for navigating the astral planes. There are three classic steps to manifesting any experience of life including astral projection experiences. Step one is all about vision and getting clear about what you desire to manifest. For astral projection, your desire might be to induce a fully conscious astral projection experience to the astral planes, where you will achieve a breakthrough spiritual experience that confirms beyond all doubt that you will survive death by confirming the existence of the afterlife an experience where you're briefly reunited with a deceased loved one or a beloved pet. Step two is all about purpose and defining how this manifestation serves you and others. For astral projection, your purpose might be to get closure with a deceased loved one or a beloved pet. This very worthy purpose serves to help end grief and suffering by showing you firsthand that death is but a doorway back to our spiritual home beyond. Step three is all about ritual, which is dedicating yourself to maintaining a daily astral projection practice. This meditation is designed to help with steps one and two, and your daily astral projection practice covers step three. Okay, let's begin. First, choose someone you completely trust, someone who totally supports your astral projection practice, because they will be the one you celebrate the success with when you succeed. If nobody comes to mind, just choose me. You can share your success in the comments below and I will respond. Next, Choose the one astral projection experience you desire to manifest in your reality more than any other. Something close to your heart. Something you've longed for for a long time. Maybe you'd like to meet a guide or helper face to face. Maybe getting closure with a deceased loved one or beloved pet. Perhaps visiting an alien world to reassure yourself we're not alone in the universe. Or maybe you'd like to visit the Akashic Hall of Records to review your past lives and current life plan. It's important you focus on just one desire for these 30 days, because as a seasoned out-of-body explorer, two of the most powerful insights I've discovered are, we live in a thought-responsive universe where focused, sustained thought brings our imagination to life. So be consistent with your vision during this time. Take a moment to get clear now. Now, with clarity and purpose, take a moment to think about how it would make you feel to manifest this breakthrough astral projection experience within the next few days. Would it make you feel happy, joyful, excited, reassured, inspired? Define the feeling now.
later in this meditation, you'll use this as your core astral projection feeling to fuel this manifestation and bring it to life. Okay, let's manifest this. Relax and close your eyes. Scan your body. Are any muscles tense and stiff? If so, focus on these muscles and notice your body's natural ability to choose to relax these muscles. Notice how the lightness of relaxation begins to soothe these tense muscles, helping you to relax even further. Now, focus on your breathing and let it become slow and comfortable. Each breath brings oxygen to each cell of the magnificent body, bathing your cells in deep relaxation. As you practice this exercise over several weeks, you will find it easier and easier to relax both mind and body. Each time you do this meditation, you will experience greater depth of peace. Now, notice how you feel physically. Notice the feeling of heaviness in the muscles as they relax. Notice this sense of heaviness in the eyelids and even notice the weight of your resting hands so very heavy. They feel so deeply relaxed and heavy that even though your mind knows that you could move them, Moving them is not something you care to do. You are enjoying the stillness, even for a brief moment during a busy day. Now, notice your feet also, feeling very heavy and deeply relaxed. That's good. With the creative part of your mind, imagine you, the stressed you, heavily relaxing right now in this moment. Also imagine a new you, a courageous you, composed in that part of the mind where creativity exists. This courageous self begins to feel a sense of lightness. It is a lightness that transcends any heaviness, and a lightness that feels as if it can rise above you. Feel that creative and courageous you now. It is that part of you that knows it can handle any situation. That part of you that is capable of healing during difficult times. Let that feeling of lightness begin to float out of you and above you, as if the real you has found a way to rise above the stress. As you both relax and float, Allow that creative part of your mind to continue to imagine the real you, the creative and courageous you, rising above your stress. You can even travel high up and far away to see yourself transcending both the place where you are and the time constraints imposed by stress. Allow yourself to enjoy the feeling of being beyond any limitations, pressures, comparison, or stress. Just feel the sensations of serenity, peace, and freedom. You can let your mind drift, dream, and float, becoming detached from any worldly stress. Rise above to a high place, a place where your higher self can truly succeed and use all of the internal strengths that are deep within you. Pay attention to your feelings of confidence, freedom, and joy. These are not states that I have created, but rather states that you have created by simply taking a moment for yourself to set aside stress and tap into your inner resources.
yourself feeling relaxed and focused. Imagine the sensations of successfully leaving your body. Hear the subatomic sounds of your chakras opening. Sense the powerful vibrations as universal energies flow freely through you. Feel yourself peel away from your physical body as you lift away into a brilliant light. Take a moment to imagine yourself floating above your body. Feel the expansiveness and freedom of movement. Feel your consciousness rising upward into the light. yourself to float freely in the light, just floating free in the light. As you float freely in the light, focus your full attention on the one astral projection experience you desire to manifest into reality. Start by focusing on the essence of your desire. The essence of your desire is the core astral projection feeling you get when you think about your desire manifested as reality. How would you feel if this experience manifested right now? See it, feel it, experience it as already being so.
essence of your desire. Ignite this manifestation with the spark of synchronicity, the light of love, and give it over to the friendly forces of the universe. Radiate the energy outward as an all-spreading vibration that ripples across the whole of the multidimensional universe. Feel it spreading across all time and space, beyond the illusion of separation, spreading throughout infinity. your desired manifestation delivered into the hands of destiny, let it go. Because from this moment onwards, it's not your job to manifest your desire. Your job is to remove all the doubts and fears that stop destiny from delivering your manifestation into your hands. Now, imagine yourself returning to your body and celebrating. Imagine celebrating with the person you chose. Imagine hearing them say something positive and supporting like, I had absolute faith you'd succeed, congratulations, and hugs. Imagine lots and lots of celebratory hugs.
This guided meditation was read by Todd Akamises and brought to you by your friends at astralprojection.com.